Welcome back to a new episode of Let's Go See It. Today we're in beautiful Washington, D.C. at Key Bridge Boathouse. I'm going to take you for a full tour so you'll know exactly what to expect should you decide to go ahead there. I'm also going to go to two boathouses which are a stone throw away so you can find out which boathouse is best for your money. In this shot, what I'm showing right here is the parking lot. If you decide to come here, it's a great boathouse. However, parking is extremely limited. The goal of my channel is to inspire folks to come out and see the world. And I specialize in travel ideas for individuals and families who are visiting or live in the DC metro area. Regardless of your reason for being on the Potomac, you will likely have a good time. There are plenty of historical sites to see, not to mention it's a very calm, smooth, relaxing river. One of the features that sets this boathouse apart from others in the area is that it does not take walk-up reservation. If you want to participate with this boathouse and the activities, you must make a reservation in advance. Of all the boathouses you'll find in the area, it is the closest to the Key Bridge. It is also the busiest. It's also very crammed. If you like to be around people, if you like to have other boaters around you when you're in the water, then this is likely the boathouse for you. One of the drawbacks of this boathouse is that it has the smallest selection of watercraft. Unless you want a kayak, this is not going to be the right fit for you. The Potomac is a wonderful river. It has lots to see and do. However, it is not at all quiet. There's always a helicopter or airplane flying overhead. There are other boathouses in the area. Less than a mile away is Thompson's Boathouse. The prices here are identical with Key Bridge Boathouse. However, the parking here is horrendous. I want to introduce you now to Fletcher's Boathouse. It's located a few miles upstream, but it's far more peaceful, tranquil. It has tons of free parking. It has a park that's available to the public and it has a lot to offer. At all the boathouses, you can launch your watercraft for a $6 fee. However, at Fletcher's, you can launch it here for absolutely free. This is the time in the broadcast where I do a shameless plug. If you want to see all there is to know about Fletcher's Boathouse or Thompson's Boathouse, visit my channel and I do a full review of both locations. This is a small channel. Your subscriptions, your like, your following me, it means the world to me. If you enjoy this, I recommend you look at my channel for other fun, interesting things to do in the DC metro area. As always, thank you for your time and I appreciate you watching this video.